here with Joel Rosario, jockey at the fairgrounds for the weekend. And Joel is originally from the Dominican Republic, is that right? Yes, I'm originally from the Dominican Republic, yeah. And, uh, you know, great to be here, Louisiana, riding. Uh, did you ride in the Dominican Republic? Or? Yes, I did. Oh, and yes, I, I rode there for like six years before I came. Well, here since 2020, your horses have earned about $100 million, and you had some really great horses there. You had uh, Nixco, mm -hmm. Echo Zulu, Goof, Goofo, yes. a lot of good horses. Epicenter is one I really liked, and uh, what I liked about him was he kind of changed his style under your guidance. He went from a front runner to a more tactical horse. Yeah, that's right. I mean, he, you know, he was a horse that with a lot of talent. He showed a lot of speed when he ran, and you know, he was a, you know, when he ran like the second, third time out, he was a little bit, but you know, as all that he got more races, that he looked like he got better, and uh, he, and he was able to just take, come off the pace a little bit to everything, whatever. Kind of you can do whatever you want with him. So he was an easy horse to ride, and uh, yeah, I mean, just uh, he was a lot of fun. He was. He won the Gun Runner here, then he. Ran second in the Le Comte. He got nailed at the wire by Call Me Midnight. Yep. But then came back in the Risen Star and the Louisiana Derby. Great memories of those rides that you gave him. Yeah, very good memory. And uh, like I said, he was a really talented horse. And, uh, you know, he did a you know, really amazing career. And, uh, you know, I'm oh. really happy where he is now. All of your horses finish so well. What do you do? What's the magic to get him to, to have some energy left at the end of the race? I mean, just... Uh, it's all depending on the horse, I think, yeah. you know, more important is the horse. I think, uh, you know, we go there to an idea of maybe what is the horse like to do or not do, and, uh, you know, maybe sometimes it's probably better you wait a little bit with him, or sometimes you go, and stuff like that, you know. You never never finish learning, you know, yeah. you never know, but, That's yeah. right. That's the great thing about horse racing, yeah. you're always learning. Yep, that's right. Well, thanks so much for your time, Joel. Of course, anytime. Thank you. Appreciate Bye. you.